Hello, welcome to this video course about building an e-learning platform using Django. My name is René Fleschenberg. I work as a system administrator and web developer. For the past five years, I've been working with Django. During this period, I've built a variety of Django-based web applications. Let's say a few words about Django. Django was first released in 2005. It is a pretty mature and solid framework. It is probably the most popular Python web framework. Django's users include companies such as Instagram, Mozilla, Discuss and others. Here is a quick overview over the five sections of this video course. In the introduction video, I will help you to get up and running by setting up a new Django project. Then I will introduce some key concepts of Django and we will take a look at Django's main components. To see how you can work with Django in practice, we will build a simple e-learning platform as an example application. Throughout the course, I will point out some common pitfalls to avoid and hint at some best practices I recommend you follow when developing with Django. In section number four, we will add a simple REST API to our application. For this, we are going to use Django REST framework, a very popular application for building web APIs. In the final section, I will demonstrate how to prepare your application for a production environment and I will show you an easy way to deploy your application to production. To follow this course, it would be ideal if you have an up-to-date Linux system. If you are using Windows or a Mac, you should still be able to follow the course. You will just have to adjust some commands that I'm showing for your operating system. I will assume that you already have some basic Python knowledge and at least a little bit knowledge about HTML. I highly recommend that you use a version control system. I recommend Git for this purpose and Git will be required to do the last section where we deploy our application to production.